Good evening, everyone. We're at the home of the Schwarz-Gelben, as they're known here in Germany, Borussia Dortmund, and what a venue this is. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Ajax. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Borussia Dortmund side, Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence, Julian Brandt plays alongside Axel Witzel in central midfield, and so many different ways to configure an attack, in this case it'll be two men up front. And here's the starting lineup for Ajax. Well it's a 4-3-3 with two out and out wingers, but they do vary their movement, they give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, there it is. The first caution of this match. Well, he didn't need to make the challenge, did he? He's under pressure now. It's a long time to go in this game. Crisp tackling. I'm being pressed here. Edson Alvarez losing possession. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Holland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable, and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Oh, great play. Holland! He can't hold on to it. Oh, chance taken! There is opportunism for you, but a disappointed goalkeeper. When you see this again, I think the goalkeeper's very unlucky. He makes a good initial save, but the ball comes off of him, rebounds straight to the attacker, and the finish is excellent. So Ajax restart the game, and we're going to find out if there will be a quick reply from them here. There certainly needs to be. Aller. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. Ooh. 
and dispossessed. Ajax pushing forward with options available, able to get a body in the way. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? He's got to have a go here. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, they were so close to the equaliser there. They're certainly a bit unlucky, but they need to make more of these chances. Holland. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Daily Blintz. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Daily Blintz. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. takes it away this attack looks highly promising oh that's a really good run able to get his body in the way oh they have the ball once more can he open them up here well that's how to put in a clean tackle well Borussia Dortmund unable to retain possession well, as you can see, Ajax have completely dominated the last 15 minutes and have created one or two good chances with it. If they can continue to play... Oh, they could put it away, Stuart. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. And teammates to play it to. Determined defending. Takes the shot. Can they cover up? Well, they can keep possession of it now. And a chance to level it. Oh, did so well to deny him. Short corner it is. Mazraoui It's with Berghaus Edson Alvarez well, They've given him too much space Well the half-time interval almost upon us and it's so far so good for Dortmund Stuart, your overall take Well they've worked hard and played well to be in front here but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time Good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Edson Alvarez. Here's Berghaus. Ryan Grafenberg. Tadic. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position.
has eyes for goal not the worst free kick in the world but the goalkeeper equal to it and the electronic board delivers the news two minutes of stoppage time well that is how to run at defenders but quick thinking defensively and there the first half ends here in Dortmund This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee. This is looking threatening. Can he put it away? Well, nothing comes of it. Well, credit to him for trying it. Didn't miss by much. Blitz. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. It's with Berghaus. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Well, what on earth happened there? Well, as you can see, Dortmund are struggling to control possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. Oh, Stewart's a chance! Well, the keeper had to concentrate. And Dortmund will go to the bench. The corner played into the box. Is this the moment? Closing down well. Safe pair of hands. Did his job. Thirty minutes to go. Then an effective challenge. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. Constitution it is for Dortmund. Well, racing past his man. Gonna get a try. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Emre Can. Holland. Holland. Long way out. And nearly extending their lead. Well, it wasn't quite the finish he was looking for. He just couldn't quite keep it on target.
Sebastian Allaire. Mohamed Kudus. Strong but fair tackle. 20 minutes to go in this one. And he's lost custody of the ball here. And space to attack. The cross is on. Sebastian Allaire. Lisandro Martinez. Mohamed Kudus. Just cutting off the supply. Marco Reus. And Borussia Dortmund in a position of menace. And that's a high-quality stop. Well, it may not count for anything, but that was a great save, wasn't it? And they will make the change now. And over comes the corner. Not messing around with that clearance. Witzel. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? And Dortmund will go to the bench. happy the bar was there very quick thinking there well that would certainly have put the game to bed but there's still a bit of time left here tremendous ball played through well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner Royce taking this one. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Well, they have it again. Dusan Tadic. Wonderfully weighted pass. Oh, what the goal! Right out of the top drawer. Who could do better than that? Well, you won't get tired of watching this. The improvisation, the skill and the end product. What a goal that is. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time and winning it back. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Able to get a body in the way. 
can't get the shot through. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides.